So we're going to use the following information to find the composition of the F and G and the composition of G and F are these functions inverses of one another, where F of X is 2X minus 1 divided by 5 and GX is 3X plus 1 divided by 4. So let's look at the first part, which is the composition of the F and G or F or G at X, which is the F of the G, we treat G as the input, so this is 3, X plus 1 divided by 4. The input of the function F, we multiply it by 2, and then minus 1 divided by 5. For the function F, the input is used to multiply by 2. So 2 times the input, which is 3x plus 1 divided by 4, subtracted by 1 in the entire thing here divided by 5. We're going to treat it in the easier way. So this one, as you see, 2 and 4 here reduced to be 2. And then when you divide, it means multiply by the reciprocal. We can rewrite it as 1 over 5. Multiply by 3x plus 1 divided by 2 and then minus 1. And next, we're going to simplify in the parentheses. Make it the same denominator. So we get 3x plus 1. And since the denominator is 2, so this treat it as 1 over 1 or 2 over 2. So this minus 2. And we write it to be 1 over 5. 3x minus 1 quantity divided by 2. Or 3x minus 1 divided by 10 as the f or g of x. Next, we're going to find another composition function, which is in the form of the g of f of x or g of the input f of x. Replace the f of x with the term 2x minus 1, all divided by 5. The input of the function g will be multiplied by 3 plus 1 and all divided by 4. I'm going to rewrite this as 1 over 4 multiplied by 3 times 2x minus 1 over 5 plus 1. And I'm going to simplify the inside of the parentheses. To find a common denominator, which is 5, then we get 1 over 4, 3 times 2x minus 1 plus 5, all divided by 5. And next, simplify to be this one, I'm going to write in different colors. So this is 6x minus 3 plus 5. Negative 3 plus 5 is plus 2. In the parentheses, we obtain 6x plus 2, all divided by 5. Factor the 2 out becomes 2 over 4 times 3x plus 1 divided by 5. Simplify a little bit more to be 1 over 2 times 3x plus 1 divided by 5. Or 3x plus 1. divided by 10, which is very close to the composition of the F or G. Now we got both of them. The next part is to determine whether these functions are inverses of one another. To be inverse of one another, the property is the F composed with the inverse equals X. Also F inverse composed with the F going to be x. For this case, both, both compositions not equal to x, not equal to x. Therefore, the answer is no.